And we're back. So, the character creation sheet, pwede siyang kunin online or sa official website ng, uh, ng Wizards. Uh, free to free to download and uh, bahala na kayo to print. It's usually three pages. Uh, but we are going to focus more on the first page. Uh, this is the most important part dahil dito natin nilalagay yung name, uh, race, uh, class and level, pati experience points if you are going to use experience points uh, for your uh, for your campaign, especially uh, the alignments and the race, or uh, the alignment of your character. Uh, the alignments uh, to brush on it is uh, kung ano yung pinakaugali niya or paano siya i-roleplay. Uh, isa ba siyang chaotic, chaotic good uh, na human ranger? Or isa ba siyang neutral na, na elf? Or isa ba siyang uh, chao uh, chaotic evil na, mm -hmm. na dark elf? Mm -hmm. So, dito siya nilalagay sa uh, top part para madali mo siyang tingnan. Um, on the left, on the right part, right, right? Yeah. Okay. Right. So, the right, on the right part, uh, part dito natin nilalagay ang ating ability scores. Um, if you're pl uh, playing RPG games uh, mm -hmm. uh, either online or on your console games, ito yung uh, six basic uh, abilities na uh, kinocustomize natin for our character, uh, whatever the race or the, the class of it. So, yung anim, uh, your strength, your dexterity, uh, constitution, um, intelligence, wisdom, and perception. So, guys, ano ang strength? It's more like, parang power. Right? Power? Oh. Good. Um, Riel, ano ang dexterity? Parang tapagwa siya agility. Agility, good. Um, constitution is yung magdi-determine kung ilang palo ka bago ka mamatay or uh, ilang palo bago ka mag-fade. Endurance. Endurance. Intelligent, uh, intelligence is your book smarts mm -hmm. and wisdom is your street smarts. Uh -huh. Minsan, napag uh, napagbabalikan natin yung dalawang yun. But, uh, mm -hmm. uh, but on D&D, intelligence is kung gaano mo, ka, ka, gaano ka kabilis mag, or gaano ka kabilis magsabi ng information. And wisdom is paano mo siya na-apply. Mm -hmm. And the last one is charisma, which is the strength of your personality. Mm -hmm. So, uh, it could go from 10. 10 would be the normal, or yung com uh, the common, which is at uh, plus zero sa uh, sa yung skill checks which is going to be tackled later so nakukuha natin ang ating ability scores on three uh, different ways first ang um, pinaka common is the standard array in which uh this these six numbers pwede mo siyang ilagay sa kahit na anong stats uh, and those numbers are 15 14 30 uh 15 14 12 10 and 8. Mm -hmm. So, kung tinatamad kang mag-roll ng dice or gumawa ng point by, uh, point by which is yung other two, is you can just use the standard array to put in on your ability scores. Bahala ako sa maglalagay. Uh -huh. uh, the second way is, of course, rolling the dice mm -hmm. uh, to give a uh, randomness. Um, uh, for 5th uh, for edition, we need 4 uh, D6 dice. So, 1, 2, 3, and four, roll them six times, and get the lower, or tatanggalin mo yung row, uh, pinakamalit. On this case, um, six, four, three, five, tatanggalin mo yung three. Then, i-add mo tong tatlong natira, then that would be your one of your numbers. Then, so, tatanggalin mo yung dice na may, may pinakamababang number. Yep. And, do it again six times, and that will be your numbers. And the last one, which is, um, kind of an advanced thing is the point buy system. Uh, sa point buy, uh, you have 27 points to spend. Then, uh, you have 10, uh, 10 uh, stats on all. Then, every po uh, every point, uh, or every uh, additional points up until uh, fifth, uh, 14 is going to be uh, 1 point. Then, after, the, after 14, uh, every point is 2 points. Gets, uh, uh, gets uh, and then, so, once you have those numbers, six numbers, bahala ka kung, uh, bahala kung saan mo siya ilalagay. Or, and this will help you on how will you roleplay the character. Uh, ikaw ba ay isang all-brawn, no-brains, 
na, na barbarian or gusto mo bang maging uh, seductive uh, seductive na bard which is kind of awesome uh, to be this seductive bard kasi you're not using combat in solving everything oh, so you, karisma- charismatic yes, ka talaga ka. charismatic ka talaga character which is hindi uh, uh, to get away with combat uh, combat or conflict hindi always using your bronze mm-hmm. you also need to use your brains mm-hmm. which is uh, which is the joy of uh, D&D dahil ang dami po pwedeng gawin in regards to uh, role playing mm-hmm. so uh, in regards to so on the big box sa uh, character creation che- sheet natin doon natin nilalagay, uh, nilalagay yung numbers kunyari uh, let's just use standard array so 15, 14, 12 uh, 15, 14, 12 uh, 15, 14, 12 10 uh, 15, 14 uh, 15, 14 12 10, 8 nakalimutan ko isa 11 yata 11 so te, uh, 10 and 11 would be the plus 1 uh, uh, every every 2 would be plus 1 on your uh, on your abilities mm-hmm. uh, which means um, okay actually ginagamit siya on these uh, the skills there are 16 skills uh, on the character creation sheet uh, which is yung pinakamadalas natin gawing checks in regards to uh, interaction with the uh, interaction with our surroundings so example uh, your acrobatics will use uh, your dexterity so if uh, y- you are proficient so it's, a, it's a, one of uh, the keywords is proficiency mm-hmm. uh, which is if proficient ka sa acrobatics you have plus two mm-hmm. for every acrobatics check plus your dexterity modifier which is uh, example you have plus two uh, based on your raw ability score so every time na mag, uh, mag-roll ka ng d20 dice uh, for a check example for an acrobatic check so uh, the, uh, example the scenario would be this uh, pagpasok mo sa kwarto biglang bumukas yung floor at nahulog kayong lahat do an acrobatics check Pwede pala yun. Pwede uh, sabihin ni, ano yun, uh, ni, ni Dungeon Master yun. yun. And uh, sabihin niya, kailan niyo mag-roll ng mas mataas sa 15 uh, to safely uh, to sa- uh, to safely drop. Uh-huh. So, uh, you roll a d20. Mm-hmm. Nangyari, nakakuha mo is 10. So, uh-huh. plus your proficiency with acrobatics plus 2. Mm-hmm. Plus your 2 yes. na ability score. Uh-huh. So, that is equals to 14. Which okay. is mababa. So, uh-huh. Uh, example lang yan. Uh, so, by 14, eh, so hindi ka umabot, sabi ni Dungeon Master mo, you tried to do a somersault para to, to cushion your fall, uh-huh. but halfway through, narating mo, na yung, uh, narating mo na yung baba. So, you fall on your back. Ouch. Ouch. Really okay. ouch. So, from the skills, there are 16. Uh, depende sa class kung ano yung magiging proficient ka. Example, if you're uh, if you're a cleric, uh, you have proficiency. Uh, you you need to choose three from uh, from a set. So uh-huh. kunyari, pipili ka ng three from arcana, medicine, um, stealth and survival or something like that. Mm-hmm. Then pipili ka daw ka proficient or kung saan yung plus two. And every level, madadagdagan yung proficiency points mo, mm-hmm. uh, which is may kita mo yon sa uh, sa class sheet. Uh, depende sa class na gagawin mo. Uh, example, if you're a level 1 bard, uh, a level 1 bard, mm-hmm. meron ka na agad proficiency na plus 2. And pag narating mo yung level 4, magiging plus 3 na yung proficiency mo. Plus your raw modifier. So oh, that's may bonuses na dun. Bonuses na dun. And, of course, uh, isa sa mga nilalagay din natin sa ating first page ng character creation sheet is the saving throw. Okay, so the saving throw works like this. Um, there's an orc na biglang umataka sa'yo, then you need to brawl with him or uh, to wrestle him. Uh-huh. Then, uh, to, um, to save, you need to do a strength save uh, to be able to either to topple the enemy or kaya mo siyang salagin or ma-overwhelm ka nung orc. Uh-huh. So, the... Um, the saving throw depends on uh, the modifier of the enemy. 
mm-hmm. and the difficulty nung action na gagawin niya. So, example, uh, the orc that is going to grab you, ha, uh, you need to do a save, uh, uh, a strength save uh-huh. of 15. So, roll a d20 plus your raw modifier and your um, your proficiency mo on athletics, uh-huh. which is your strength. Uh-huh. So, uh, i-add mo lahat yun, then that would be your saving throw. So, Kailangan mas mataas sa 15. Of course. Kumara yung sinabi ng DM. Sinabi ni DM na so, ang difficulty sorry. nito. Then, we also have our armor class, which is uh, yung number na kailang ma- uh, ma-hit mm-hmm. uh, para tamaan ka ng enemy. Mm-hmm. Uh, every class have uh, their own uh, way uh, kung paano yung armor class nila independent sa item mo. Mm-hmm if you have a higher uh, armor class. Uh, pinaka-basic is 10. Uh, yun, pag unarmored ka, or wala, wala kang armor, uh, you have 10 an uh, armor class. So, the enemy, or yung kalaban mo, just need to roll a 10 or above, tatamaan ka niya. Um, there are spells na makakapagpadagdag ng armor class mo. Uh, there are also feats uh, na magpapadagdag ng armor class mo uh, para mas mahirap kang tamaan or mas madali ka makasalat. Then, the initiative usually is um, your dexterity modifier plus your percep- uh, perception or your passive perception mo. Uh, the initiative is always be... Um, okay, mali yata. Sorry. Uh, hindi pala kasama si, per, uh, si passive perception. Uh, your dexterity plus uh, your d20, uh, kanyari, you have a dexterity of a plus 3 uh, mm-hmm. na modifier. Uh, so, initiative is plus 3. So, initiative is ganito. Uh, naglalakad kayo sa forest, uh-huh. then ambush. Uh-huh. Roll for initiative. Or, uh, on, that, uh, on, uh, on a session, yan yung pinaka-signal that uh, there is going to be a combat happening. Roll for initiative. Pag sinabi ng DM yun, mag-ready na kayo ng d20 dice, roll, uh, kung ano yung number na lalabas plus your initiative mm-hmm. which is your dexterity and yun yung magiging uh, yun yung magiging order nyo in battle or the order of turns mm-hmm. so of course mas mababa would be nasa, nasa huli ka ng turn uh-huh. or nasa unahan ka um, then para kung maga kung gaano kabilis na magre-respond yung para para magre-respond yung uh, uh, ganun siya tumatalab kung uh, inaratel um, ambush Startled kayong lahat Roll with disadvantage So, dalawang dice D20 Kung yung bababa Kukunin mo Plus your dexterity modifier And yun yung mag initiative mo So, kanyari uh, your, yung, go, yung, yung, yung umambush sa inyo Na goblins Would be uh, Have an initiative Of 15 mm-hmm. Then, ang nakuha nyo pl- uh, With your initiative Was 13 or 12 So, mauna yung goblins Na umatake Dahil startled kayo dahil hindi kayo agad nakapag uh, hindi kayo agad nakapag respond on the ambush kaya na ambush so that's the initiative is 4 speed uh, speed is usually kung gaano kalayo yung kaya mong abutin or uh, layo ng pwede mong i-move on every turn uh, standard human or a human has a speed of 30 feet so every turn pwede lang siyang gumalaw in, uh, 30 feet lang ang pwede niyang igalaw uh, kada turn Pwede niya, uh, pwede siyang uh, 15 muna, then 15 on his next, uh, basta hindi niya pa nakoconsume yung buong 30, meet, uh, 30 feet. Uh-huh. Uh, on, on your adventure grid, uh, depende kung ano yung scaling, that is at least 6 boxes or uh, uh-huh. 6 grids mm-hmm. na pwede mong igalaw, either diagonal, side to side, or backwards. Um, on the movement, uh, it's a little advanced uh, stuff. Um, the... Um, you also have an option to do dash in which your speed mo will be doubled. So if you have a 30 feet uh, speed, magiging 60. However, nah, you, hindi ka, uh, magiging 60 feet yung movement mo, your movement speed, kaso hindi ka pwede umatake. Uh, so for movement lang yun. For movement lang yun. For flee. For flee. Uh, uh, pag suma ng mga tao sa monster. Okay. And the next one would be your current hit points mm-hmm. uh, in which um, nakukuha siya depende sa class uh, example a barbarian has a d10 1d10 uh, na 1d10 na hit points na dice so 10 
plus the constitution modifier. So if your constitution is plus 2, 10 plus 2, 12. You have 12 hit points. So, tataas yan. Every level, uh, you can just uh, roll the dice. Bitan nga for your, uh, for, your hit, uh, for your hit dice. Mm -hmm. uh, kung ano yung lalabas doon plus your constitution modifier, yun yung magiging dagdag na HP mo. Oh, Maradagdag naman siya. Maradagdag naman siya every level. Siyempre naman. And, the temporary hit points is usually kung ano yung uh, hit points kapag nakashield ka or meron kang barrier. Oh, yun yung yun yung unang mababawasan bago yung regular mong hit points. Oh, parang siya yung absorb. Uh, oh, siya, yung absorb, absorb. siya yung health mo on top of your... Yep. Mm. And then, sa, on the first page, kasi lahat ng information nandito, uh, syempre, your, your, H, uh, your HP, kung gano'ng kalayo mong travel or gano'ng kalayo yung movement mo, you also have your hit dice. Mm -hmm. uh, it also depends on, on your class, but uh, on a short rest, kunyari, uh, you have 4d6. Mm -hmm. Pwede mong gamitin yung apat na d6 na yun to regen. Huh? Yun yung iro-roll mo to, to regen your lost hit points. And mapupuno lang ulit yung hit die mo or yung hit dice uh, when you do a long rest. Or kayo yung magde-design na kung mag-short rest kayo or mag-long rest. So, a short rest is usually uh, 3 to 4 hours. Uh, game uh, game time sa game time yun, uh -huh. yung sa real time. Uh -huh. And a long rest is 8 hours which would uh, replenish everything. HP, your skill slots, everything, and everything. everything. And pati yung hit day mo. Uh -huh. Example, sinabi nyo, we'll do short, short rest. Kukunin mo yung dice mo, kunyari, for the 4d6, kuha ka lang ng dalawa. Mm -hmm. Roll mo, then yun yung magiging, magre-replenish yung health mo mm -hmm. on that short rest. And my favorite, death saves. So, uh, on uh, the interview of uh, Joe Manganiello uh, with uh, or with uh, Stephen Col uh, on the Stephen Colbert show with uh, Joe Manganiello, uh, nasabi niya yung tungkol sa death saves, in which uh, if your character uh, was uh, uh, was into zero hit points mm -hmm. or yun pag nag zero lang, kasi uh -huh. if may sinad uh, your life or yung hit points mo is three na lang. Then the enemy's attack is three, so zero. Because if you don't pass that, then you're dead. Na in dead na talaga. But if you drop into zero, uh, your your DM will tell you do a death death save. So a death save is being done in three, uh, in three, uh, three d twenties. So three d twenties. Or actually, it's a three because you need uh, three success. So that's a uh, uh, a roll of fifteen pataas mm -hmm. or uh, nine, uh, actually it's uh, yeah fifteen pataas. Uh -huh. And pag nagawa mo siya na tatlong beses, you'll be revived with one hit point. Ah, uh, dapat bayan. Three success. Three oh. success. So wala three is to zero. Wala probability na two is to one. So, dapat limang best, best. Limang best mo siyang i-roll din. Kailangan na tatlo doon successful. Okay. Ah, okay. So, five times tatlong, mo siyang i-roll. So, dapat sa three is to two. Tatlong dice. Oh, tatlong, tatlong dice ang success. Mm -hmm. oh, tatlong, tatlong dice ang success. Tatlong roll yung success mo. Okay. Kahit yung dalawa yun. Okay. So, yun lang yun. Uh, that's the death save. And, the other one is your uh, attacks and spell casting. How, uh, actually, on this part of the character creation sheet, uh, it's your weapons. Kunyari, you have a long sword, a bow. Mm -hmm. uh, so, on that, meron kang proficiency. Yung profici uh, example, if you're proficient with a bow, mm -hmm. uh, every uh, every attack or atta uh, an attack roll with a bow would have a plus two. Uh -huh. So, uh, sabihin mo, gagamit ako, ng, gagamit ako ng bow to attack. Roll for hit. So, mm -hmm. uh, the difficulty para may... Or, uh, 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 kunyari, uh, the armor class of the enemy uh, example uh, gamit ulit tayo ng or orc mm -hmm. an orc has uh, a armor class of 15 mm -hmm. nag roll ka 10 mm -hmm. plus your proficiency uh, mm -hmm. for bow which is plus 2 mm -hmm. plus if uh, meron kang sharp uh, sharp shooter feet mm -hmm. may plus 2 ka ulit mm -hmm. and your dexterity uh -huh. Uh, modifier which is plus two. Uh -huh. uh, if you have a plus two on your 
uh, strength uh, or your dexterity modifier. So, i-add mo yun lahat, yun yung may hit mo. So, uh, that's 16, if I'm not mistaken. And, so, tatama ka uh, with your bow. Yun lang naman yung ano dun. Uh, we also have this what we call a finesse weapon. Uh, a finesse weapon is something that you can throw. Uh, it's a throwable weapon. And, uh, pwede, mong, pwede kang pumili if uh, either a strength check, or a dexterity uh, or, uh, if, or dexterity modifier ang gagamitin mo uh, for that for uh, for that particular attack. Uh, that's uh, a finesse weapon. Um, under the attacks and spell casting uh, is your equipment. Uh, example, uh, you have a starting. Uh, every class have a starting uh, equipments. Uh, example, uh, you have an amulet uh, for safekeeping or uh, also your cash or your pera mo. We have one, two, three, four, five uh, currency uh, on uh, on fifth edition. That's your gold, uh, electrum, which is half silver, half half gold. Mm -hmm. Ewan ko kung paano, paano mo siya i oh. compute. So electrum, mm -hmm. silver, uh, bronze, and your copper. Yun yung currency na ginagamit for D&D. Pero di syempre, depende sa campaign nyo, uh, kung paano gumagana ang currency sa mundo, uh, on, uh, sa mundo nyo. And, uh, yan. Uh, that's for the equipment part. So, personality uh, trait, dito mo ilalagay kung ano yung ano, outgoing, or happy-go-lucky, or dark. Kung mag-ayan yung parang lord o parang yung, yung well-being. Uh, yung well-being ng character mo. Ideals, kung ano yung pinaniniwala niya. Uh, is your character believe in justice? Believe in love? Uh, believe in order? Uh, law and order ang, ang, ang ideals niya. Bonds, uh, dito mo ilalagay kung ano yung uh, what he cared for. He, does he care for her, uh, for his lover, his uh, brothers and sisters, uh, the parents? D uh, dito mo ilalagay sa bonds. And flaws, of course. Uh, every character has his flaws. Uh, example, uh, I have uh, yung pinakauna kong character uh, for uh, for Dungeons and Dragons uh, was actually a ranger, a human ranger uh, na walang direction ses uh, sense. So, para siyang si Zoro pero ginawa mong archer. So, when you say Plus, ito yung imperfection, ito yung mga bagay na nagpapa-complicate nagpapa-complicate yung... sa kanya. Or example, uh, uh, yung character mo is uh, yung trait niya or is uh, one of his trait is um mapi, uh, mapili siya sa pagkain pero yung flow niya is kapag nakakita siya ng karne hindi niya mapigilan sa rin. Okay. Something like that. That will uh, make your character interesting. Mm -hmm. And this last big part here was actually the features. Yan. Uh, features are feats, are uh, uh, bonuses uh, na pwede mong idagdag sa character mo. Uh, depende sa class or depende sa kung ano pang uh, custom, uh, custom ang gusto mong ilagay. Example, uh, a feat. Uh, example of a feat uh, is uh, yan, uh, a sh uh, sharpshooter skill. Uh, if you have uh, a sharpshooter feat, um, mababu, uh, pwede mong i minus five or sorry, uh, a sharpshooter is you have proficiencies or additional proficiency with your attack rolls, mm -hmm. range attack rolls uh, of additional plus two. So okay. madiba, uh, or uh, the uh, the bowmaster skill mm -hmm. uh, or feat uh, na kapag gum uh, gumamit ka ng bow, uh, babawasan mo yung roll mo, yung die roll mo ng minus five. Pero, uh, pero, pag tumama, uh, pero pag tumama ka, uh, yung damage mo will be plus 10. Okay. Or some, uh, something like that. That's your feat. Mm -hmm. Or uh, uh, another feat na pwede mong gawin uh, on, your, uh, on your character uh, is, uh, uh, is a, um, what's this? Um, an artificer or a, uh, a historian. Mm -hmm. uh, pwede, uh, it, uh, it, uh, it works both as a background and your feat. So, uh, example, if you're an historian, uh, you'll have advantages for historical checks. So, example, uh, you're on a tomb or on a dungeon, mm -hmm. then there are writings on the wall. Mm -hmm. uh, gagamitin mo yung historical uh, feat mo mm -hmm. to read that uh, writing on the wall. Parang sa Oh, So, <laughs> uh, uh, pwede mo naman gawin sa, ano yan, sabihin mo sa DM mo, uh, babasahin ko kung ano yung nakasulat sa wall. 
meron akong ano, meron akong background on history and uh, or background on history. So sabihin uh, ni ano, oh sige, roll, roll for history check. Uh, nag-roll ka. Then may lubas number. Uh, example, uh, the difficult uh, the difficulty of uh, reading uh, the uh, the text on the wall is 13 plus mm-hmm. your history uh, plus your uh, so nag-roll ka 11 mm-hmm. then you have plus 2 sa history checks. So that's 13. So sakto na basa mo kung ano yung nasa board. Dahil kasi may meron kang background ka may background ka nang ano. Para sa class pa kaya. Or, yep. or profession. Profession. So that's the first page. I know it's too long. Kasi dito mo talaga ilalagay lahat uh, for your damage, your hit points, uh, kung gaano ka kakunat, uh, your basic personality traits na so pag nagroll ka or you, uh, you need to something to check immediately uh, the first page is yung una mong titingnan mm-hmm. so let's move to the second page yay second page na po tayo so okay so uh, we are now on our second page after nung pagkahaba-haba explanation for the first page but uh, the second page is uh, for your extra personalization sa character mo if marunong ka magdrawing you could uh, draw your character appearance here um, you could also put allies and uh, allies in organizations kung kasali siya na uh, kasali siya on a, uh, on a guild or a cult pwede mo siya ilagay dito um, general uh, character backstory di pwede mo siya ilagay dito and yun of course for the backstory kahit anong backstory that you could uh, you could do So, yun, example ko ulit yung pinakaunang character na ginawa ko. Um, yun, uh, he's a directionless ranger uh, na ang gusto niyang, mang, ang pangarap niya sa buhay is uh, to create the first world map. Wow! How ironic! <laughs> diba? How ironic. But he, he has the direction se- a sense of uh, Roro no Wazoro. <laughs> so, ganun ko siya, ano? Uh, ganun ko siya ginawa. And of course, uh, additional features kung uh, may pelegis ba siya mukha or uh, mm-hmm. ano siya, mayroon ba siyang pang-anim na kuko sa kamay or uh, uh, physical features. Physical features. And yun, treasures. Kung ano yung uh, mga iniingatan niya na gamit or treasures na nasa uh, na, na lagi niyang dala-dala. That's on the second page. Uh, extra personalization stuff lang yun. And the final page is spells. Dito mo ilalagay uh, the spells that your characters know mm-hmm. uh, to to just brush on it. Um, cantrips is the spells na walang uh, na pwede mong gamitin forever. Walang requirement. Walang requirement. As in, kahit anong class ka? Hindi. Uh, uh, cantrips is your low level spells. Parang uh-huh. simple fireball lang. Basic. Mga basic, basic, basic fireball. Basic. Uh-huh. Uh, na pwede mo siyang gamitin paulit ng paulit ulit. Uh, parang pan level 1 skills. Yep. Para siyang yung extra skill pag mm-hmm. nag-run online ka. Uh-huh. Regen. Uh-huh. Remember Regen? Uh-huh. Kahit ispam mo siya. Kahit ispam mo siya. Uh-huh. Wala siyang wala siyang bearing sa so, ano. So baka ko dun ha. <laughs> Regen ha. So, of course, you have your level 1 skills. Uh, this circle, na blank circle, uh, kailangan mo siyang lagyan ng indicator o kukulayan mo siya o lalagyan mo siya ng dot if that is your active uh, active spell or passive uh, hindi, not really passive because if uh, you are a sorcerer kailangan mo i-mix and match yung ano mo uh, i-mix and match yung spells mo then there, there are just uh, a number of spells that you could uh, summon because if you're a or uh, sorry uh, if you're a wizard uh-huh. natututo ka ng kahit anong spell pero iilan lang yung pwede mong i-cast uh-huh. na malalagay mo sa spell mo uh-huh. limited lang limited lang Eh, eh, hindi katulad ng bard. Uh, a bard, when he get uh, access to level 1 skills, lahat yun natututunan niya. Pero iilan lang yan yung pwede niya gamitin as active skills. Okay. Pero lahat na nalulearn niya. Lahat na nalulearn niya. Wala siyang na-unlearn. Yep, wala na-unlearn. Kung parang yung bard, na siya yung walking mp3. Walking mp3, oh. yes. So, so, favorite ka sa bard. May bard kami sa session namin. And yung favorite niyang gamitin as uh, lagi was THUNDERSTRUCK! Sabay, sabay ka na, na mag... Uh, Thunderstruck ba? ng ACDC. ACDC. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm <Ganun>. willing! Baka <laughs> uh, makapirate na. <laughs> Yan, so that's it. 
ito lang naman yung ano natin uh, for the spells uh, uh, to brush on some other things spell casting ability is kung ano yung gagamitin mong save on some of your or, or mo, on most of your save uh, on most of your spells so kunyari ang spells mo would use wisdom or would use intelligence mm-hmm. uh, to, to be cast or uh, yung modifier niya uh, spell save DC o uh, kung ano yung uh, kung anong ability yung gagamitin nila example if you are uh, ang karamihan ng spells mo were uh, mind control spells uh, the spell save Eh, or the spell save is usually ang gagamitin nila is uh, a constitution a, uh, sorry, not constitution um, a charisma check or a charisma, uh, charisma save then spell uh, spell attack bonus, syempre kung ano yung uh, example, a fireball uh, has um, yung, depende sa intelligence mo if it's plus 2, plus 3, plus 4 uh-huh. ito ilalagay mo, so example uh, a regular fire, uh, a fireball uh, has a damage of uh, 3d6. So, magro-roll ka ng tatlong d6, mm-hmm. add them, then add your uh, intelligence modifier. Okay. For uh, for the final damage ng fireball attack. Then mo na siya ikakalculate. Then mo na siya ikakalculate. So, uh, yun, D&D do, uh, does a lot of math, pero most likely addition and subtract, uh, subtract, uh, su- subtraction lang naman yung gagawin doon. Um, but we are going to brush everything in regards to spell casting uh, and uh, combat on our next episode. So please watch out on that. So uh, thank you for um, listening with us uh, or me rambling uh, for over 30 minutes. Uh, I may have uh, said uh, things na, uh, wrong or inaccurately. Uh, I really do apologize on that. I'm learning. Um, I'm talking. Uh, on top of my head and also I also need to have things simplified uh, not uh, not just for me and also uh, for my friends here then pare pare uh, noobs in regards to uh, dungeon and Dra- uh, uh, dungeon and dragons so again if you really wanted more of this um, like share subscribe and See you on the next adventure. Bye. Bye. Bye guys.